Howdy YouTube, Darlington Farm here. Well, as you can see there, I have been playing with some cans in my weld positioner. Let me show you this guy here. I absolutely love that. I hit the foot pedal and it just rotates. Yeah, not super, super amazing, but I am getting the feel. Let's see if this will focus here. There we go. I'm finally getting the feel of using the positioner here. Um, so not the super prettiest weld in the world, but I am getting the hang of it. The, what seems to be giving me troubles is getting the start-stop there on those aluminum cans. Seems like I'm okay to run it here, but uh, it just is kind of giving me a little bit of trouble to make them super pretty. I uh, got some other sprite cans here where I was just uh, kind of doing a, uh, you know, holding the rod in the puddle and letting the positioner do the work and it's no ripples or anything and then on this one I was actually kind of dabbing here so kind of trying to feel around with what works also this one I was using 16th electro or 16th 5356 filler and on these I was using 332nd and doing like a lay wire uh, just trying to see what looks nicer basically because um, yeah I'm just trying to start getting back into doing some more work like this and handing these guys out uh, with a business card and um, yeah I want them to look good and uh, finally starting to get the feel of it which I'm pretty excited about um, it's a lot easier to do this on the positioner I used to do this just on a piece of angle iron or angle uh, aluminum here where you do a little bit rotated do a little bit rotated and it was never as even as I would like uh, it usually impressed enough people to where I would get work but it was just not as good as I would like and Brendo why are right, get off the ladder dude before you hurt yourself I don't know why he is using uh, his feet to play with the drawers on my toolbox anyway yeah so let me go through the settings here um, on what I am using I'm running pure argon on this um, now I did pick up a bottle of helium here and I absolutely love it and I'll do a video on that here shortly but I'm running about 10 CFH on the Argon, and let me take you through the settings on my machine here. Oh, I'm running a number nine torch uh, with a 40 thousandths lanthanated tungsten, or 2% lanthanated tungsten. Uh, I am running 250 hertz, 75% uh, on the balance. Let me focus here. Uh, 30 pulses a second, 80% for the peak, 5% the background. Uh, let me go to advanced settings here. I've got it set for 40 thousandths tungsten and I am running advanced square wave. Now I was reading about uh, the triangular wave uh, form being better for thin aluminum and it kind of minimizes the heat input. I had a really hard time uh, on startup with the triangular waveform where it would just blow a hole right through the aluminum. Uh, on the, the can bases there. Now again, I, I don't know if it's maybe I have some other setting wrong But I had a really hard time with the triangular wave. So I switched back again to uh, The advanced square wave which seems to be my kind of go-to waveform uh, With this machine um, and I'm running oh 25 amps as my and then to kind of controlling it on the pedal uh, and then I'm usually somewhere kind of, you know, half, three-quarter pedal, something like that. So if you are trying to weld aluminum cans, that will get you in the ballpark there. Um, also, I picked up a water cooler, and I took some video of this thing and getting it set up here and was getting bugged the crap out of, by my kids and accidentally formatted the card, so all that footage is gone. But uh, so far, I'm really digging my cool mate 3 i'll do a video on it here um, i was going to do like an unboxing video but i accidentally formatted the card i'm running a just a number 20 i think it's 20 torch um yeah absolutely love it so far especially mixing some helium in the mix there uh you can run a three or excuse me you can run a 16th electrode and you can f run full pedal at 200 amps with it. It's really awesome with a little bit of helium mixed in. I am totally digging that. I haven't had a chance to play with it a whole lot other than just kind of, you know, plug it in, make sure it works. Uh, do another video on that, but I just thought I would share kind of pop can settings there. Anyway, I'm Darlington Farm. Thank you for watching. Please check the back to the channel here and hope everybody has a good week.